Next to me I have another blown N54. This came out of Pirate's BMW 1M. It had done 25,000 kilometers at 25 PSI and then lasted not even one run at 29 PSI until it failed. So today we're going to tear it down and find out what went wrong. This car meant business. It had Mosselman 15T twin turbos, port injection and fully 85. Same as last time, we're going to quickly check over the basics. The engine still turns over freely and the Vanos solenoids don't have any debris hiding in them. So we're off to a good start. Out come the spark plugs which all look to be in pretty good shape too. Off comes the valve cover and straight away the first thing you'll notice is that the internals look almost brand new. This is the result of being meticulous with regular servicing, especially before heading out to the track. I'm going to quickly flip the engine over and pull the sump to see if there's any surprises in there. With the sump removed, again this all looks practically brand new inside. Overall though, there's no clues here. Alright, let's flip the motor back over and prepare for the head to come off. Out comes the chain tensioner, cam sprockets and chain guide. This next step isn't totally necessary, but I'm curious to see the state of the cams while we're in here. With the cams removed from their trays, let's check them out. And to nobody's surprise at this point, they look brand new. Now it's time to remove all 14 bolts securing the head to the block, then off it comes. Stick around for part 2 where we find the culprit.